Crews are still working to contain a fire on signal, which has burned about a thousand acres now. People were evacuated from their homes in the Boston Branch subdivision on Sunday night, and they have not returned since then. It's Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Kate Smith continues our coverage tonight. Let's get the latest now from Kate. Well, Cindy and David, volunteer firefighters say they have accepted hundreds of bottles of water and Gatorade for field crews, and they all agree on one thing. It's a great problem to have. Face just lights up and they say it's like Christmas, so we're just we're just really overwhelmed. Donations aren't trickling into Walden's Ridge Fire Hall. They're pouring in one by one neighbors drop off donations, hoping to bring comfort to firefighters. What community is all about and Signal Mountain and our surrounding areas, they have just so stepped it up and we are so grateful. Jonathan Johnson rode his motorcycle up the mountain from Chattanooga to drop off supplies. He understands the long hours being away from home. Oh, perfect. Thank yeah. you. Husbands and sons and daddies and everything else too. So it's kind of different. I mean, I used to be a firefighter, so I understand kind of the firefighting side of it. He is one of many looking to help and show support to the men and women working around the clock. Proud to be a Chattanooga. Uh, when Chattanooga has a crisis, they come together and unite. That's one thing I love about Chattanooga. At a nearby staging area for the forestry team, a sign notifies the public that they have enough water and snacks. Crews appreciate the support, but wants everyone to remain safe. They ask the community to drop off donations at the sheriff's office or fire departments. And to limit some traffic through here for safety concerns, not only for the public, but also for our firefighters. We want to maintain the ability to get in and out. On a day celebrated for veterans and their service to our country, this veteran says it's all about giving back, no matter what kind of uniform one might wear. No matter what kind of uniform that you wear, whether it's blue, um, like the chief was wearing white right before he left or green like I did in the military. Uh, it takes heart and uh, it comes from here. Now we have been taking a lot of calls into the Channel 3 newsroom about how you at home can help these field crews. There is a donation drive tomorrow between 10 and noon at the um, Dallas Bay Food City or the Saudi Daisy Walmart. If you want to drop off water or Gatorade, snacks, protein bars for these firefighters who are working around the clock, Scenic City Serves will be accepting those donations again from 10 to noon tomorrow and then delivering them right to the firefighters after noon. Um, and if you have any information or you want information, just head over to our website at WRCBTV.com. In Hamilton County, I'm Kate Smith, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.